Hey guys, Neil here, and we're here with the Fast Lane's predictions. We've got Casey here. You guys may not have seen him much because I know this. Our viewers right now are kind of mixed with a lot of Minecraft, but this is Casey. He's the one that obviously bought the mic. He buys it a lot for the channel and stuff. But yeah. uh, I'll I'll be doing a uh, about me video here sometime in the next uh, few days. I have a couple days coming up, so expect that probably by Wednesday. Yeah, it'll be good. I'll do one right afterwards too. Cause that's I didn't know he was planning on doing that too. But anyway, yeah, let's get to the picks. Nice prediction. Got to get this video up before fast lane starts. We're always way late about it. But um, we're not going to do the pre-show. Um, it's a cruiserweight tag match, which I didn't even know about. I didn't even write down who was in it. Um, but uh, we're going to... I don't know. you have anything to say about that? Um, we pretty much fast forward past the cruiserweight stuff um, on, on Raw to save time. Yeah, very true. Okay, first match tonight... Sami Zayn versus Samoa Joe. Um, that shouldn't be the first. It might be the first match of the night, but it, I got Samoa Joe. I mean, really? <laughs> yeah, he can't. He can't just debut on the roster and then lose a match. It's, a, it's just they build him as a, a monster. <laughs> yeah, injuring Seth Rollins. So no, he can't. If you're dumb enough to think, yeah, it's, yeah. If you if you th it, it, the only way Samoa Joe loses is like Seth DQ. Rollins comes. Yeah, DQ. That's it. But no, we both got Samoa Joe easy on that one. But yeah. Next one, uh, Sasha Banks versus Nia Jax. Nia Jax. She's got Nia Jax. Nia Jax has been dominant. And I was going to go Sasha Banks because she's been beaten up quite a bit. But if they're really trying to build towards a uh, fatal four-way match uh, for the women's title at Mania, um, Nia Jax needs to win. Because you can put Sasha Banks. She's so over. You can just put her in it anyway. So, yeah, Nia Jax. It's a easy easy pick there, I think. But I don't know. I want to go against Neil, but I can't on that one. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah. Speaking of that, <sighs> if you guys didn't know, there's a little competition. Um, I am the champion, reigning, undefeated, undisputed champion. You're disputed. There was a tie. If you... I won one. I know I won one. You can say whatever you want. The title's on my shoulder. But, yeah, guys, um, obviously, loser loses the title. We might eventually get to some... Um, Bets that we have to lose, but yeah. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> next match: Neville versus Jack Gallagher. Gallagher, Gallo. I don't even. I can't even. Gallagher. I'm pretty sure it's Gallagher. I'm pretty sure it is, but I don't have an R on here for some reason that I wrote down. But yeah, I Neville. <laughs> Again, I have to go with. <laughs> don't worry, we're getting all the common ones out of the way. <laughs> it, Neville, I if it, Neville loses it any time, it's going to be a mania. It's it'd be really hard to see him lose it. I mean, I, I think the first time he should lose it should be at SummerSlam. They like they they need one champion because they they've already had like three title changes for they they need one one guy to be the champion for a while to to make that belt mean something what, like what the Miz did with uh, the IC or, uh, or last year. Can't agree more. <clears throat> Can't agree more. So now that we got the easy ones out of the well, no, we got one more easy one. Women's title match: <laughs> Bailey versus Charlotte Flair. It's ba I got Charlotte. I almost said Bailey. <laughs> you all heard him say Bailey, right? Uh, yeah, Charlotte. She's she's not losing her streak until WrestleMania. Yeah. No way. <laughs> she might not even lose it in Mania. Who knows? But yeah. Anyway. Yeah, that's easy. All the easy ones are out of the way now. Now we got the tag titles match. We've it's Enzo and Cass versus the champs, um, the club or whatever you want to call them. Um, who you got, Casey? I got the club. I think Enzo and Cass need to go over at WrestleMania. It'll be more more for them to go over at WrestleMania. So that's that's what I'm going with. I want to agree with that, but I'm gonna go. Oh, man, I didn't pick this one. I didn't write it down. That's a tough call. Uh, I think I have to. Yeah, man. I'm gonna go with. The club as well. It's tough. To, I guess Enzo and Cass are the second best selling tag team in the WWE right now, behind, of course, the New Day. But um, yeah, it's tough. I I could see it going that way, but I gotta go with the club. You're right. I think Mania is where they finally get it if they do. Dang, that was hard. I was so close to going the other way, but yeah. Anyway, now we got Roman versus Braun. We got big guy versus big guy. Um, both way over guys with the company, maybe not with the fans, but uh, who you got, Casey, and why? Braun, because they built Braun to be such a monster. 
So, I mean, yeah. Yeah, I think it, uh, yeah. It's the Go only on. way I, I see Roman Reigns winning is if Braun gets himself DQ'd or a stupid count-out thing. Yeah. And I know, and it just plays so much more into the fact that Undertaker is rumored to be there tonight. So I'd say if Braun's going to win, of course, mm-hmm. Braun's going to win. Dang, man, we got to pick different. Uh, we'll pick different in the final match. It'll come down to the main event. You know what I would love? Finn Balor comes out to mess with somebody and Undertaker interferes with Finn Balor. You say Finn Balor, and that's probably the only way Samoa Joe loses. Hint. Um, but, yeah, it's got to be Braun. It's, it, yeah, just, it's just that I don't see there's any way that Braun could win. Even if, I don't know, who's going to cost him the match? Finn Balor, he's going to be Finn Balor versus Braun Smith? Could be. I don't Who is Braun Strowman's opponent going to be at Mania? I have no idea. Yeah? I mean... Oh, dun dun. <laughs> didn't, didn't he throw... No, no, he didn't do anything to... Taker wasn't in, in uh, the Rumble last year. Yeah. Taker, if he comes back, he's coming for Roman, for sure. But, yeah. yeah. Well, that's, anyway, that's we both picked Braun. Styles. Yeah, that would be fun. But, final match. This one, we might be different on. We got the Universal Championship. Kevin Owens versus Goldberg. I'll big pick mine now. I got Goldberg. Goldberg. You can't build a guy that strong and have him lose. I mean, if he's disqualified, okay. I'll take that disqualification. But that's even that's crazy. I don't know. Like Kevin Owens wins or retains. Retains. Uh, retains. Well, that's way different. I don't know. It's hard to retain. Well, who's going to win? That's the question, Casey. And I got Goldberg. I didn't say who the new champ was going to be. We can do a bonus point. Who's going to be the new champ? Who's going to win, Casey? I'll just go with... I'll just make it easy. I'll just go with Kevin Owens. All right. I got I got Goldberg. And I think he might even walk out champ. I don't know. But Yeah, anyways. Um, yeah, that's it. Um, let, let me comment down below with who you think is going to win. Um... Me, obviously. But, I mean the matches, of course. But, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I'm just, just going to get on WD's shop and order a steel chair. Hold on. <laughs> All right, guys. Talk to you later.